everyone, my name is Bayu Dani Dwi Putra with my friend Muhammad Sirat Ijam Majid. We are 2021 WYIIA delegation team from Senior High School 11 of Bekasi, West Java, Indonesia. On this occasion, we will present the results of our research entitled Medicland Portal, or the Medic School Safe Zone Portal, designing or the Medic School Safe Zone Portal Building. This research begins with our concern for road users, especially school students. This is due to the fact that there are many school locations that are close to the highway, but the lack of knowledge about traffic safety that's owned by students results in a high risk of accidents for students. According to data from the Lakalantas unit of the Bekasi City Police, the number of traffic accidents in Bekasi City has increased. During 2019, there were 107 Lakalantas cases and 13 deaths. Traffic accidents that occurred in the city of Bekasi experience increased during 2019. From the data from the traffic police of the Bekasi Police, there were 107 traffic accidents in 2019. While in 2018, there were 78 traffic accidents. Based on these problems, researchers are interested in creating innovations in the form of a Medicland portal tool which functions to make drivers obedient and disciplined in traffic and provide space for students to cross the road while in ZOSS. Besides for reducing the number of accidents against students and increasing the alertness of vehicle users, this tool also functions to detect carbon monoxide is contained in the air around the safe school zone and give a warning if the air has crossed the safe limit. Air pollution is a condition where the air is polluted with the presence of various pollutants beyond the threshold. We have summarized there are three diseases caused by air pollution. The first disease caused by air pollution is ARI. ARI is an infection in the respiratory tract. The second is lung cancer. In lung cancer, lung cells become abnormal so that they grow out of control. And the last is asthma. Asthma is a condition when the airways become inflamed, narrow and swollen and produce excess mucus making it difficult to breathe. There has not been any research that discussed design renewal of the design and test its effectiveness in the renewal of the design of the safe school zone. By using the building design with an automatic portal and with ZOSS user boundary markers using traffic lights, it can be used as a design for the Ministry of Transportation in collaboration with the Ministry of Education and Culture in designing a school safe zone, which is much more effective in reducing the number of traffic accidents in the school area. We still also have alternative solution advantage like traffic like system, CO gas detection, and panic button system. Research methodology. This type of design research is a series of procedures for translating the analysis results of a system into a programming language to describe in detail how the system components are implemented. The study also used the trial and error approach, which is an approach that is carried out actively in a repeated manner until a desired result is found. Aim to determine the effectiveness of using the Metricon portal tool to reduce the number of accidents in the safe zone of school and to give warning when there is air pollution around the safe school zone. In addition, the study also used the waterfall approach method. The waterfall model is used in the study because of the need for a system that will continue to be updated and refined so that it can be approached the most accurate point. Metricon portal stands for automatic safe school zone portal still have main aim of reducing the number of accidents with students and increasing the awareness of vehicle users. Both two-wheeled and four-wheeled vehicles we still requires an electric current of 7V until 12V which will be distributed parallel to the component via the 5V pin and this tool also function to detect CO gas contained in the air around the safe school zone and give warning if the air has crossed the safe limit. In addition, this tool is also equipped with a push button that functions as a panic button in the event of an accident around the place. If the push button is pressed, the tool will send a message that an accident has occurred around the safe school zone. This tool is made by using acrylic material. The advantage of this acrylic material is that it is easy to form because it has electric properties and is not easily broken. In addition, this material has relatively cheaper price as to the effectiveness and efficiency in making this unit. In this tool, researchers use the Arduino Uno R3, which is a microcontroller board based on the AT Mega 328 microchip. Arduino Uno R3 works as a brain in processing all instructions 
bus as an input and as output as well as processing input data from an array of sensor which then produce output in the form to obtain valid data. All you can see, the test result of HCS R04 sensor have a small error percentage. In average percentage deviation of error is 1.67%. We have tested the MT7 sensor system with 5 samples and the result it have small error percentage. The test result of MP7 sensor it can be seen average percentage deviation of error is 2.518%. In testing the SCS R04 ultrasonic sensor work system in detecting distance of vehicle that will pass in the safe school zone. It can be concluded that the SCS R04 ultrasonic sensor working on the metrical portal has a small error percentage of 1.67% with a precision level of 98.33%. In testing the effectiveness of MK7 sensor in detecting the CO gas and vehicle fumes, it can be concluded that the MK7 sensor that works on the metric and portal tool has an error percentage of 2.51%, compared to the CO gas meter with a full rate deviation of 3 ppm. It is necessary to make improvement to the electrical system or the resource in the metallican portal so that the component in the metallican portal both sensor, surf motor, and other indicator component can work better and more effectively. And it's necessary to add software or application as a monitoring system or indicator in the happy school zone so that can run more effectively.